Hello friends, now we see the problem number 2 which is also based on rationalization method of chapter limits. The problem number 2 is a limit exchange to 1 square root of 5x minus 4 minus square root of 5 minus 4x whole thing divided by x square minus 1. Now let's see the solution. First of all, we denote the given problem as a L. So L equal to limit x tends to 1 square root of 5x minus 4 minus square root of 5 minus 4x whole thing divided by x square minus 1. Here, the radical part that is square root present in the numerator. It means we have to rationalize the numerator. So, on rationalizing numerator, The next step will be limit x tends to 1 root 5x minus 4 minus square root of 5 minus 4x that we write in one bracket. The next bracket is square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x bracket complete same bracket we have to write in the denominator that square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x also the term x square minus 1 present in the denominator so this of the type a square minus b square by using that formula having factors a plus b a minus b therefore x square minus 1 can be written as x plus 1 into x minus 1 that equal to limit x tends to 1 now numerator first bracket is of the type a minus b and second bracket is of the type a plus b so here by using formula i can write square root of 5x minus 4 the whole square minus square root of 5 minus 4x the whole square since a square minus b square gives a plus b a minus b then whole thing divide by x plus 1 into x minus 1 into square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x. Now here square and root cancel in the numerator. So the next step will be is equal to limit x tends to 1 first term is 5x minus 4 then minus second term is 5 minus 4x upon x plus 1 into x minus 1 
into square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x. On simplifying the brackets, we get limit x tends to 1, 5x minus 4, then minus 5, minus minus, we get plus 4x in the numerator, and whole thing divide by x plus 1 into x minus 1 into square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x in the third brackets. So that equal to limit x change to 1. Here 5x plus 4x that gives us 9x and minus 4 minus 5 that gives us minus 9. Whole thing divided by x plus 1 into x minus 1 into square root of 5x minus 4 plus 5 minus 4x. So that equal to limit x tends to 1. Now in the numerator we take 9 common. So 9 in bracket x minus 1 upon x plus 1 into x minus 1 into square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x and that equal to limit x tends to 1. Now we cancel the term x minus 1 and x plus sorry. we cancel the term x minus 1 from numerator and denominator by stating the reason that since x tends to 1 therefore x not equal to 1 and therefore x minus 1 not equal to 0. It means we cancel the term x minus 1 from numerator and denominator. So the next step will be limit x tends to 1 9 upon x plus 1 into square root of 5x minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4x in the second bracket. Now here we substitute limit as x equal to 1. So the next step will be in the numerator we have 9 upon 1 plus 1 in the first bracket then square root of 5 into 1 minus 4 plus square root of 5 minus 4 into 1 in the second bracket. So on simplifying further, we have 9 upon, now 1 plus 1 gives a 2, then inside the root we have 5 into 1, 5 minus 4, so that gives 1. And square root of 1 is 1. Then plus. Again 5 minus 4. That gives us 1. And square root of 1 is 1. So finally 9 upon. Now 1 plus 1 2. 2 multiply by 2. That gives us 4 in the denominator. So in this way. We get answer as a 9 upon 4. So this is a required solution for the given problem. Thank you.